Hey, Psych2Goers, and welcome back to another video. First of all, we would like to thank you all for the support that you've given us. Psych2Go's mission is to make psychology and mental health more accessible to everyone, and you help us do that. So thank you. Now, back to the video. Have you ever had a conversation with someone that lasted the whole night? Did you feel like you could talk to them forever? Unlike physical attraction, where you're drawn to someone's physical appearance, emotional attraction is to be drawn by someone's personality, values, goals, and dreams. It's when you feel that they somehow get you on a deeper level. You may have felt this connection with your best friend or romantic partner. Some people may even mistake it for physical or sexual attraction. Before we begin, we would like to mention that this video will be focusing on the signs of emotional attraction in potential romantic relationships. If someone you know is showing these signs, it doesn't necessarily mean that they're trying to pursue a romantic relationship with you. That is something you are advised to discuss with them to see if you're on the same page. With that said, here are nine signs that someone may be emotionally attracted to you. Number one, you feel like the other person gets you. Can this person understand how you think and how you feel on a deep level? The way they can somehow get you without you needing to over-explain yourself, may be a sign that you're developing a deep emotional connection with them. Number two, they speak highly of your qualities and personality to you and others. Do they talk about how funny or smart you are with other people? It's a sign of emotional attraction if they always express to you or to other people the things that they really like about you. Whether it's how you crinkle your nose when you're studying really hard or when you cry during movies they can't help but find your small quirks and traits to be unique and endearing. Number three, you have long conversations which may last for hours. Do you text, call, or hang out with them for long periods of time? Communication is crucial for any relationship and is usually a good sign of emotional attachment. They might try to encourage your conversations to keep going or to make an effort to keep that communication as open as possible with you. Even just taking the time to ask you about your day shows that they're emotionally interested and invested in your relationship. Number four, they tell you that they're thinking about you. Another sign that they're emotionally attached to you is when they openly tell you how much they've been thinking about you when you're not together. Whether it's something you said or something you did, the memories you've made together could have made a lasting emotional impact on them and they've become emotionally attracted to you. Number five, they like spending time with you, but also give you space. One of the more obvious signs of emotional attraction is when they not only look forward to spending time with you, but also genuinely enjoy and value the time you spend together. While they may always be thinking of new things they want to do with you, it's also important that they respect and give you space for you to do your own thing as well. Number six, they value your opinions and most of your life values appear to be in sync. Do they welcome you into their personal life and share their opinions and values with you? If so, it's a sign that they're developing an emotional attachment to you. They might also show a level of emotional compatibility if they encourage you to express your opinions, thoughts, and feelings without judgment, regardless of whether they agree with you or not. However, if you do find that you share a lot of similar views on family, work, and personal life, then this compatibility may easily develop into a long-term relationship. Number seven, they're comfortable being vulnerable around you. Have they let their guard down when they're with you? Whether they're opening up to you about their past or talking about some of the most intimate moments of their lives, being vulnerable is a sign of deep emotional attraction. And this is because it shows that they're able to trust you with their worries and insecurities. Number eight, they express an interest in meeting your family and friends and vice versa. Do they invite you to their family gatherings? It's a strong indication that you share a strong emotional attachment with each other when you both wanna introduce each other to your close friends and family. After all, you're usually able to introduce your partners to your closest relatives only when you're emotionally connected and invested in that relationship yourself. Number nine, they wanna to commit to you without pushing commitment onto you. Are you overwhelmed by the idea of commitment? Oftentimes, it's not commitment we're afraid of, but rather it's committing to the wrong person. So if the person you're seeing expresses that they wanna be committed to you, but they don't push you to do so in return, then it shows that they respect your boundaries and feel a strong emotional connection to you. Have you experienced an emotional connection with someone? Let us know in the comments below. If you found this video helpful, be sure to like and share this video with those who might benefit from it. 
And don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell icon to get notified whenever Psych2Go posts a new video. The references and studies used in this video are added in the description below. Thanks for watching and we'll see you soon.